Today, I will show you that how you can go ahead and create a credit or debit note in Transact. Quickly, let's go to our transaction module. Now, this is my transaction dashboard. I will select one of my sales transactions. So this is the OC for dry fruit, which I have selected. I will click on this. Now, this is the transaction timeline, which will get opened in front of me. Now, always the credit note or debit note is created against the invoice. So where I need to go, I need to quickly scroll down. And here is the invoice which have been created. I will select that. Now, this is the invoice which will get open in front of me. On your right hand side in the very top, you can see an option of other action. Click on this. You will get an option of credit note and debit note here. So as this is a sales transaction, some of our item have been rejected. So I will create a credit note for it. Once I press on credit note, this is the credit note document format, which will get open in front of me. Now I will go ahead and put down the PO number and PO date. It is required here because I didn't input the PO number and PO date in my order confirmation. So I will simply type PO by mail and the PO date was of 10th of July. Now I will go ahead and select the payment date. So I will select the 22nd of July. Going below, there are two of the items which was in my invoice or in my order confirmation. So only one of my items have been rejected. So my raisins was not rejected, my cashew pack was rejected. So I, what I will do, I will click on the minus option and I will unselect that. Now I will put the quantity 10 gram of my cashew pack was rejected. I will select the tax here. Now going below, I will get two of the options, save as draft or save and send. So I will quickly go ahead and click on save and send. Once I will click on save and send, it will ask me for the confirmation. I will simply go ahead and click on yes. So once I click on yes, please have a look. My credit note is created. Same will be reflected in my payments module as well. So this is how you can go ahead and create a credit note. In the same way, you can go ahead and create the debit note as well from the other action in your purchase transaction or sales transaction invoice. I hope it helped you out. Have a good day.